Okay, in this video what we're going to do is show you how to build a transmission blaze grating. So we'll build a transmission target and arrange it over here and set the size under properties to the same as our other grating. With a sampling of 513 across and choose full window for the interaction region. So now what we're going to do is set the uh, material one complex refractive index and that's just going to be a glass so we'll make it a uniform glass across the full window with an index of refraction of 1.6 and we'll save this as um, Tar Blaze X, for example. Okay, and good. Now we'll go to our thickness. Now for our thickness, we need to make, I want to bring in a file that has the thickness distribution in it. And I've got a little program here called um, Make uh, Horizontal Sawtooth.m in the CGH toolbox. And this will make a horizontal sawtooth file for us, a bitmap file. And I chose 513 by 513 um, elements across the matrix with, and I chose the um, sampling of the matrix is defined in OptiScan and the width in, um, of a uh, pitch there in microns. So it should come out with the period of the grading correctly. And so if I just hit run, it'll come up with the calculated matrix and it's okay to write the file. So I'm going to save that in targets and I've already made one of them before, but I'll just make it horizontal soft here. All right, so now how we bring that into the editor is here. I'm going to replace a piece under the thickness. And I'm going to input from file, and I'll choose that uh, horizontal saw sawtooth bitmap file, and choose over the full window. And then I'm going to scale it so that the full width is one way, or the full height is one wave in transmission for your OPD. And so that's uh, one point. One, so it's a full wave for blaze grid. So that's a 1.0833 microns. And in minus six, remember everything's MKS. And there you go. And if we click on that and zoom in, you can see the profile, and it's a nice soft and here we go. Um, of course, you make a link and then clear chain and start the chain calculation going or save our project. And the pause button didn't work too well on the last one, so we'll just have to suffer with waiting on time here. We won't take too long. And there we go. Uh, essentially all the lights in the zero. 
or the last uh, one over there. And then we'll access inkwall. Oops. And um, there you go. Very nice.